What's up, everybody? Welcome into Dodger Heads, presented by DodgerBlue.com, part of the Blue Wire Podcast Network. My name is Jeff Spiegel, joined today by Scott Gearman, and a little bit of a positive injury update coming out of the Dodgers the last couple of days, Scott. Blake Trinan, once believed arguably the best relief pitcher the Dodgers have, a guy who's been out for a while, is set to begin a rehab assignment. He's been assigned to the Arizona Complex League. Give me your immediate thoughts on the Dodgers, you know, one step closer to potentially getting back a real weapon in the bullpen. Yeah, absolutely. You know, Blake Trinan, the last thing we heard about him uh, before this update was, you know, spring training, you know, early, you know, in, in March that, you know, he was cleared for a, you know, a throwing program. And then it, the news kind of went silent. We didn't know yeah. if he was pitching or if he was healthy or what kind of his de designation was, but I'm excited. This is a huge addition if he's healthy and if he has, you know, a runway for the Dodgers to feel comfortable. And this is really exciting news. Yeah, I mean, 2021, he throws 72 innings for the Dodgers, a 1.99 ERA, the FIP, the XFIP, the expected ERA, all sort of backs up how good he was. Bounces back in 2022 and throws just five innings, ends up having shoulder surgery in November. My question to you, Scott, is do you have any degree of confidence as far as what the Dodgers would be getting in Trinan? Like, I think we would both probably say you're not penciling in, like, the, the fireman that's going to be the savior for the Dodgers bullpen on the level of Evan Phillips. But are we penciling in a guy who maybe fits in that next Caleb Ferguson, Bruce Dark Gratterall's sort of, sort of tier of reliever in the Dodgers bullpen? Like what, what degree of confidence do you have in trying and coming back? I would say uh, it's kind of a TBD, man, yeah. honest, because just because of how long he's been out, he's 35 years old now. Uh, the stuff went on is, you know, unquestioned. He's got yeah. you know, some of the best pure stuff in all of baseball, you know, a sweeper and just power sinker that, you know, you know, makes you want to watch when he's out yeah. there. So uh, I would say, you know, let's be cautiously optimistic about him coming back, but still fairly optimistic that this is even happening, you yeah. know because the Dodgers sorely need him. Uh, I just hope that this isn't something where they're going to rush him uh, at all. But, you know, he's kind of on the back end of his career, man. So it's, you know, I hope he's healthy. I hope yeah. that he has enough time to build up. And because, you know, when he's going to be out there, he's going to give it everything. Blake Trinan's not a guy who's just going to give it the motions. When he's out there, he'll be he'll be giving it everything he's got and giving you upper 90s power sinker. I'm excited. Yeah. So let's let's hope he's got that time. Yeah, and sort of a tough guy who, who's pitched through some pain in the past. So mm -hmm. I, I'm with you on all that. And look, there's five or six weeks left in the season as we record this. So, you know, that's enough time for a relief pitcher to get two or three weeks of rehab assignment type stuff in yeah. and then see what happens as the regular season winds down. Let me just, as we talk Trinan, let's talk Dodgers bullpen real quick, Scott. I'm looking up stats in the month of August. For the month of August, the Dodgers bullpen has the third best ERA in all of Major League Baseball. That's a 2.26 ERA across 71 plus innings. Um, we know this group has been a roller coaster, and yet I think most people would agree there's at least talent. There's the building blocks there, even if the Almontes and the Kellys maybe aren't healthy right now. Give me just sort of big picture where you're at on the Dodgers bullpen. Is this a average group? Is this a good group? Is this a great group? A below average group, I suppose? Like, They've had a good three or four weeks, you know, maybe even six or seven weeks. Are you buying into that or, you know, give me the word you would use to describe this group. I don't know about word, but I would say, you know, word, they're getting it done. Uh, yeah. Dave Roberts is just like we talked about. He's, you know, plugging guys into different roles. It's a big conversation that I think, you know, the, one of the largest quotes we had is that Dave really had to find out who he has, what he, who he's got down there, who can pitch in different spots. We know Evan Phillips for as many times as Dave said, you know, we don't have a designated closer. The times we're seeing Evan Phillips is at the back end. Um, but I'm, I'm fairly, you know, I'm in on the Dodgers bullpen. They're just getting it done at the moment. And for where they are with a lot of injury designations, Shelby Miller's picking up a ball. He's tossing, you know, Blake trying and now Bruce stars yeah. for as many times as I want to knock the guy for not striking people out. He's going in there finding, you know, not finding big parts of the barrel and getting outs. So that's really what it takes. And Ryan Brazier, what a refreshing ad, right? Yeah. That's just, so, you know, 
it's not the most elite group that they've had in recent years, without a doubt. And, you know, Yancy Almonte falling off has been difficult because he was such, he was a rock last year. Yeah. So I like what they have just for the fact that they're getting it done. And, you know, that can change at any time, but until they don't, until they're not getting it done anymore and, and yeah. blowing up games, which they've been on, on a really good run. Uh, I'm going to say that I'm in and I'm, I'm liking what they've got working. Yeah, and I'm going to amend the stat. Since July 1st, the Dodgers lead Major League Baseball in wins above replacement from relievers and have the best DRA. So July wow, was man. even better. They're third best in the month of August, but they are best in baseball from July 1st on. I know one of my bold predictions was that they'd have a top three bullpen. The final year stats aren't going to bear that out, but I feel at least some semblance of um, you know correctness there as – They've put together a stretch. And again, you know, we talk sample size and yada, yada. I mean, that's 167 innings, 142 appearances for the bullpen to have the best ERA, the best wins above replacement uh, is worth pointing out. And, and again, the update today is that Blake Trinan sent out on a rehab assignment and uh, we'll see what happens. So make sure you're checking out dodgerblue.com because that's where you're going to get the most up-to-date news on when does he start pitching? How do those performances look? What are the reviews that we're getting out of camp? So, Make sure you're following DodgerBlue.com, DodgerBlue1958 on social media. So thanks again for joining us today. That's Scott Gearman. My name is Jeff Spiegel. As always, this is Dodgerheads presented by DodgerBlue.com. And of course, go Dodgers.